is, of course, the topic around the world tonight. Back with coronavirus concerns, many of you have asked why vacationers are not being turned away from places like Sandbridge, especially when the Outer Banks banned them weeks ago. It has to do with the state you live in. Ten of your side's Brett Hall explains. Yesterday, this photo was making the rounds on social media, showing the parking lot of a Sandbridge vacation home packed with cars, cars that could well be driven by people from another state. That possibility didn't sit well with many. But know this, vacationers staying at either hotels at the oceanfront or Sandbridge, they can be here and are not violating any of the governor's orders. And until he changes his mind, the city of Virginia Beach can do nothing but encourage it not to happen. You may say, are you telling me that Dare County's leadership in North Carolina has the authority to ban visitors, but Virginia Beach's mayor does not? That is exactly what I'm saying. That's the difference between Virginia and North Carolina laws. Now, in Virginia Beach, a spokesperson says the city is still trying to do what they can. Acting city manager Tom Leahy will be sending out letters to the more than 2,700 short-term rental operators this week, encouraging them to follow social distancing measures as much as possible which could mean canceling rentals. The one in the picture is managed by Sandbridge Realty. They make pretty clear on their website that you can't do much here if you come anyway. That's the latest. Brett Hall, 10 on your side.